Well, new this morning, armed with her camera and boundless creativity, a Colleen woman with a passion for capturing moments opened the doors to her dream studio in a once vibrant part of town. But little did she know behind the walls lay a distasteful reminder of life in the South. Pretend like you're pressing down on a table. Perfect. When it comes to the vision Condice Cooper has for her clients, nothing is out of focus. For me, it became therapy, and so I really love that interaction and connection with people. The Colleen photographer spent half a year turning this old 1951 diner into the studio of her dreams. Her team of builders worked nonstop, and she was finally able to open kinetic images in June. And so they were literally working up until about 45 minutes before my grand opening. <laughs> and so there was a lot that happened in when you're renovating a 75 year old building. But during the demolition phase, she noticed something strange on this wall. I know that wall don't say what I think it says. And I just got this immediate chill. It was a sign of America's dark past. I think this wall says no colors allowed. I said, and so we're just trying to make out the rest of the letters, but as you start peeling back, we're pulling pieces of it off, but it was just this immediate sense of history. Kinetic Images is located on Avenue D in downtown Killeen. Back in 1951, African Americans were not allowed on this side of town. Seeing the image gave Condice mixed emotions. That, that was overwhelming for me. Um, but exciting at the same time because knowing that history, but then knowing that the progression of, of what that is. And, and I'm a hometown girl, and so being able to own a piece of my home, knowing the history of this area, it's, it's a fantastic sense of accomplishment. Condice was the recipient of a small business grant given by the city of Colleen to help promote economic growth and development in the downtown area. I'm excited because I'm also I'm now on the downtown advisory committee for the city and so finding out okay what do the other business owners need? How do we bring more foot traffic? What creative ideas? Condice says her goal is to be successful and connect with the community one camera flash at a time. I am definitely in the season of I'm going to say what I want and then I'm going to create the plan to go get it. All right, well, Condice told me she is following in her father's footsteps. Now, Micah, he was a photographer many, oh, many wow. years ago in Colleen. He is now the owner of um, Caribbean Flavor Ice. Mm. I know you may remember that ice. You had it downtown. And I had to go back and get it another day. I had day. to go get another one. Yeah, <laughs> so this family is really doing their part to help with the growth and the development in the city of Colleen. And so. listen, you know, I just, I'm new here, but it's so great just to see all these businesses open yeah. there, you know, that were one closed like she was telling us about mm -hmm. next door you know had some construction yeah. that needs to be worked on yeah. no one was there now they're filling up filling up yeah and it was once a time where you know people like us weren't invited to that part of town and now look helping with the growth of the city crazy